Hello and welcome to Jackson County High School. My name is Zach Evans. I will be teaching Algebra 2 and AMDM. AMDM stands for Advanced Mathematical Decision Making. This will be my first year as a teacher, but I have been in the school system since I was probably about four. I'm a graduate from Jackson County, class of 2015, and after high school, I also started coaching football and wrestling. I've been coaching wrestling for the past six years. I am the head middle school coach, while I also assist with the high school. I am the defense coordinator for the middle school football team, and I love being able to be in the classroom around students, helping and guiding them, as well as after school helping and guiding the athletes. Um, I love giving as much as I can to every single student, just as my teachers did to me. And I want to be able to make that impact on each student's life. A little bit about the courses, all right? For Algebra 2, um, you're welcome to bring a graphing calculator, but we will be most likely using Desmos majority of the time. Desmos will be able to help you type your equations in and, and it will give you a graph as well as giving you a t-table for that graph. Um, in, in the presentation that is linked below, you will find that that we, for our learning system, we use Canvas. Canvas will have everything. Um, it will have our quizzes, it will have homework assignments, along with that. Um, the syllabuses are linked below as well. The syllabus will have, um, the syllabus will have our resources and what the courses are about. Um, you will also find there is a link to the math supply list. So the syllabus should have the math supplies for the classroom and there's also a link to what, as a department whole, what we expect the supplies to be. Um, especially using, in math, it's especially good to use pencils. Pencils help you erase. If you make a mistake, you can go back and erase it. Um, I personally would like composition notebooks because we will do warm-ups before we get the class started to review the previous topic of the day before um, and being able to also have a just a plain old folder being able to put in homework assignments um, graded quizzes graded test which that will also be on canvas um, I want to be able to the students keep up with their materials make or keep up with their homework their assignments or quizzes Everything because those can be references back to, okay, what am I missing? What what part of the concept was I missing? We go back and look at it, and then we can also talk it through. Um, my communication with parents, students, um, you got my email is attached as well, zevans at jcss.us. I will also be using Remind. Um, I'll be sending out a code for that later. Um, we'll be using Remind to communicate with the parents. I don't, um, with, you know, and students with knowing when something is due, when something, when a test is coming up, when a quiz is coming up, making sure that everybody's on the same page. Um, for me to be, you know, for me to be successful in the classroom, I got to make sure that the students, me, as well as the parents, are all on the same page of what the expectations are, what what do we need to do to make sure that the students meet those expectations and its requirements. Um, and so, you know, I, I plan on sending out the important stuff. I don't want to bombard um, everybody with a bunch of reminds, you know. Uh, I want to just make sure that everybody's getting the important stuff out. Um, I'm looking forward to a great year, and I'm looking forward to seeing every student coming in here on July 30th, Friday.